What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another reaction video. So, haven't reacted to an NFL highlights reaction video in a while, other than the Steelers. But either way, we're reacting to the NFC Championship, Eagles beating the 49ers. Let me just say, this is a Mickey Mouse win for the Eagles, okay? Fortunate quarterback, almost the fifth with Christian McCaffrey or the fullback, whoever was back there after Josh Johnson went down. Brock Purdy can't even throw the ball more than 10 yards after injuring his elbow. Penalties, I mean, that roughing the punter or kicker, whatever the official name is, he got blocked into him, okay? Either way, Eagles I know are a good team. I'm just, I hate the Eagles. As a Steelers fan, I do hate the Eagles, but uh, either way, we're checking out the highlights. Let's get into it. Posted this late because I was waiting for the NFL official highlights like that they post on the app. They were not posting forever, so I was like, I'll post uh, YouTube. So I was waiting this whole time for nothing. So that's why I posted late. Won't do the same with the Bengals Chiefs game, which I'm trying to watch. Great catch, though. But like I said, I mean, if Purdy plays this game, it's a close game. The 49ers defense is doing everything they can in the first half. They gave up 31 points, yes, because, okay, in the second half, the 49ers offense can't even get past the 50-yard line. So, I mean, there's only so much the defense could do. This might be the one-handed catch that was not a catch. I mean, nice play, but it was not a catch. Now, that's not so much the ref's fault. Jimmy okay, good position. This is just I mean, you got to challenge that. Teach the receivers. If you're running it's a hard camera angle. It's, it's hard for the referee to see that also. But deep. that's not a catch. The yeah, right there. It dropped. I'm sure they weren't showing that on the Jumbotron for Kyle Shanahan to challenge that. But got to have guys telling him to challenge that. Did a lot of time, too, to challenge. And he gets in right easy. That could all been avoided. But still, either way, it's still a close game. I mean, the game's not out of it. Gonna throw it on first down. Standing over the middle, George Kittle. Ready to throw. Penalty flag. The offense is obviously looking pretty smooth. It's a healthy Brock Purdy. And then right there, I, I, it didn't even look that bad, to be honest with you. It was a fumble, obviously, at the review. But like, look at this. This ball is clearly hit. That is an I mean, I guess looking at it now, I can see an injury, but to make it that bad, I don't know. Sort of like a freak injury. The fact where he couldn't throw the ball more than 10 yards, just an unlucky day for the Niners. Then we saw Nick Bosa down on the sideline too during a punt. He was on the sideline. I guess somebody ran into him. He injured his knee or something. But... Unfortunate. Johnson and Johnson, I mean, right here, too. Basically just giving the ball away. That's the right, best choice right there. Don't want to throw it downfield, risk interception. Here's Jalen Hurts looking to throw. Quick throw for A.J. Brown. Gets a block. Brown rumbling forward. Third and nine here. Hurts is protected. Going deep. A.J. Brown overthrown. He had him. Why did they even show that as a highlight? That's a waste. Left in the first. Johnson back to throw. Slings on a good throw. They can make a lot of these highlight videos shorter. The second and short. Hand off McCaffrey. Right up the gut for a first down inside the 35. Now what about the starter? Is there more magic now with your fourth string quarterback? Here's Johnson, about to tell us. Pressure comes, throws has been taken down by Javon Hargrave, and the signal is he's Hargrave, do I miss him on the Steelers? They have to get to the 24, penalty flag. Johnson in trouble, throws incomplete. But this whole offense See, I don't know if that's, uh, if that's highlight worthy. There's no doubt about that. And Hurts in trouble. This, though, that would have been huge. This would have changed everything if they would have got a safety for that. Like I said, the defense is holding them. Like, the defense is doing everything they can. Good coverage, good front seven, good pressure on Jalen Hurts in the beginning. But you can only do so much. You know what I mean? I mean, Chris McCaffrey did everything he could, too. I mean, that's the person you got to rely on. Him and George Kittle and Debo. On first and second down. 
is McCaffrey right side breaks a tackle good shifty move get that so good. see what I'm saying like the fact that he was a pro ball snub I get it it's a regular season award but either way the fact that he did not make it and Miles Sanders did and Tony Pollard did over Christian McCaffrey he better get he better get the pro ball well obviously Miles Sanders is going to the Super Bowl so he won't play so McCaffrey better take his spot just running through, he should have been a pro bowl over a uh, mile Sanders either way no disrespect to Miles Sanders but come on now and now it's the Eagles see if they get the offense going third and two it is Hurts with a nice move and a spin and he is gonna be short but we've seen in recent weeks they do have this is cool I played rugby first couple years of college and uh reminded me of that of a scrum but this is still a close game. And the, def the 49ers defense is literally doing everything they can. He's been playing good pretty uh, lately. Yeah, now it's starting to, starting to fall apart now. Hurts. Sanders getting a block from Johnson way over there, but Greenlaw flies over to make a great tackle. You can see why. Second down and five. Sanders gets it left side. Big room and a touchdown for Sanders. 14 7. Second. I think we're going to see soon. I think it was in the first half. Might be this play when he just drops it. No. Uh, okay. Gonna throw it. That's pretty aggressive. And in stride, Sam. That's good. Oh. The first, down. the first down play sets the tone for a two minute drive. Yeah, here it is. Come on now. Listen. Who's gonna get it? You're a backup quarterback. You don't got to go out there and play like an MVP. Just don't turn the ball over. Simple, simple mistakes. You can't have that. Something like a drop snap. You can't have that. I mean, that was a good snap. The Eagles have it. It's ridiculous. Urge to throw it. Has time. Quickly over the middle. See, you don't gotta add this to highlight. Just just cut that out. You can save a lot more time on the video. That can't happen though. Scott is in touchdown, Philadelphia. Well, to the 49ers defense. Literally. Their defense. They're on the field so much with this terrible, poor performance of the 49ers offense. 49ers can't catch a break. Look, look at this. Oh, nice. That was a nice play. That was a nice play. But still, you're only a couple of minutes into the uh, third quarter. And you're already going. You're already putting the ball away. But yeah, two and a half minutes into the game or into the second half and you're already getting the ball away and the 49ers defense right back on the field why, why is that on the highlight reel I mean, that's all really pretty could have done today President called late hit on that gonna throw it pressure Excuse me, I'm yawning from that. Like, why is that a highlight video? Like, why is that a highlight clip? A little seven-yard run. That's why I like to react to the other highlight video. Because it's like the big plays, important plays only. Third down. Hurts with pressure, low throw, bobbled, and a great catch and a first down. A lot of low throws from Hurts, but Eagles receivers are catching them. Like, what's the point of that? Hurts, design run, lead block of Kelsey. Hurts, first down. He takes a lot of big hits. His effectiveness as a runner deteriorates. Another design run and breaks a tackle. Hurts. Still on his feet, first down and more, first and goal. Yeah, it's obviously flag. At that point, that's just 49ers frustration. Here's another scrum, though. I like that. And this right here ends the game.
tired. I'm yawning. And he showed clips of the second press conference as a result of this game could have been so good if Purdy wasn't injured. It was a good, fun defensive game in the first half. And Elijah Mitchell was down too, so they couldn't split it. Fourth and two. Samuel is buried. Fletcher Cox. Maddox. Eagles take over. Gainwell's got it. Cuts to the outside. Good move. Good speed. And a first down. Gainwell again. This. Third and seven. Tackled immediately as Gamewell that time by McGill. Kick is up and it is good. Debo Samuel back deep. Going to take it on out. And breaks a couple of tackles. Samuel still on his feet. That would have been going. huge. Like I said. Last year, Debo was fun to watch. He was that team MVP. This year, injuries did not help. You got to do some tricks. I mean, right here, though. Just got to get rid of it, I guess. Excuse me. It's tied behind their back, and... Yeah, Boston Scott getting the carries. Gardner Minshew. They've been magic all season. Their season's going to continue. It's Scott right up the gut, just running out time. And the Eagles on fourth down will just go. That seals here. the game. Give it to Gainwell up the middle. First down. The Philadelphia Eagles are going back to the Super Bowl. It was a fun, exciting first half. A lot of people say, no, it's not exciting because it's not high scoring. I like defensive battles like that. Um, so the first half was fun. Second half, not so much. 49ers just got unlucky. I don't think the Eagles were, what, three touchdowns plus a field goal better than 49ers? I don't think so. Either way, the Eagles are going to the Super Bowl. They're still a good team. I know that. I think the Eagles will lose. I think the Chiefs or Bengals are both better teams than the Eagles. We'll see. Hope you guys enjoyed, though. I'm out. Peace.